on Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Friday wrapped up his two-day visit to Uzbekistan. On day two of his visit on the sidelines of the SCO summit, Prime Minister held talks with presidents of Russia, Belarus and Tajikistan. Prime Minister also paid floral tributes at the bust of late Lal Bahadur Shastri in Tashkent. India and Russia discussed ways to enhance cooperation in the civil nuclear energy and hydrocarbon sector as Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Russian President Vladimir Putin vowed to take forward the special and privileged bilateral partnership. Modi and Putin, during a meeting on the sidelines of the Shanghai Cooperation Organization Summit in Tashkent, discussed a range of bilateral and multilateral issues of mutual concern. PM in his discussion with Afghan President Ashraf Ghani during the SCO summit raised the issue of the unfortunate kidnapping of Kolkata-based woman Judith D'Souza in Afghanistan. The PM requested Afghan President to expedite efforts to rescue Judith D'Souza and extend all possible support to her family. PM's first bilateral of the day was with the President of Belarus, Alexander Lukashenko. Both leaders reviewed diverse aspects of the bilateral ties and emphasized the need to take relations to new heights. Attaching strong importance to extensive cooperation with Tajikistan, the PM held talks with Tajikistan President Emomali Rahman. It was also decided to celebrate the 25th anniversary of the establishment of bilateral relations in a manner befitting the strong bonds between the two nations. The Prime Minister paid homage to a great son of India by offering flowers at the bust of former PM Lal Bahadur Shastri in Tashkent. The PM interacted with Yaakov Shapiro, the Uzbek sculptor who made the bust of Shastri. The enthusiastic children present there greeted the PM and PM Modi gave autographs, warmly reciprocating the gesture. <laughs> On the whole, PM's visit to Uzbekistan for the SCO summit was short, yet productive one. With Nandini Mittal, Sudhakar Das's report, DD News.